I'm Vest, I represent the Atom Crew and I come from Poland. I started with graffiti when I was like 13 or 14 and then switched from graffiti to the mural art. So I don't have the exact date when I started to paint mural because it was like a growing process. Um, but let's say around like 10 years, I'm doing big walls. I'm 32. Yeah, but the first walls were really bad and so I don't count them as a kind of uh, my process. But yeah, I was like around like 13, 14 when I started. Um, basically, when I started, I was doing only letters, but then I kind of got bored with it and trying to look for something different. And I started to do characters, but they were really like graffiti characters. And then I went to um, art school and I learned how to um kind of see art in a different way and then try to do something different um and i never decided to go that way but it was so natural for me that i just um went to figurative art um and now it's just um just like reading for me i don't know it's just something so natural that i never thought of why i'm doing it or or how i started doing it but just it just it was just a process that went so smooth that i didn't even think about it to tell the full stories like the atom crew started um back in the days when i started to graffiti and i started with, with my friend from my hometown but then he had to stop painting from different reasons and so i kind of got alone with the with the mural with the graffiti and and and, and walls um, and then I went to study and um, we became friends with Siner, but we didn't know that I didn't know that he paints and he didn't know that I paint. So one day he came to my house and he saw some spray cans and then he was, yeah, he asked me if I do paint. I showed him my works. He showed him uh, his works. He showed my, me his works and, um, and we decided to make just one wall together. And we did it and we liked it so much that we decided to make more and more and more. And then I asked him to join the Atom Crew and to be as a partner uh, in crime. Um, and yeah, and it's, and it's still today. From few walls around the world, everything changed to like a big thing. Like everybody now wants to have a wall in his city. So now it's harder to find a really good walls. And you have so many of them that I kind of stopped even watching because it's just, just too much. And just every day you have different people, different works and, and it's hard to follow everything and working. I mean, it's good. Like everybody can paint now. Everybody can do big walls if, if they just want, and they don't need to have like the graffiti background or the graffiti story. You just want to do big walls, just go and do it. And it's kind of nice because we always thought about it. Like we never, we never asked nobody when we started. So. When we started, nobody even heard about street art. Nobody called it street art. Like a smooth way of, of showing emotions without showing emotions. Yeah, so the title I hope is going to be so open that people can just tell their own stories about it. When I study, I, I draw my wife. And yeah. I paint my wife often and, and I used to paint her like all the time. Um, and paint objects from the photos. I always make photos for a reference. Um, so it's, um, so it's always the surrounding or the people around me or just, yeah, like I said, faces that I can find and, and then use. Now I paint what I, what I, what I feel like I want to paint now, and then we're going to see what's going to happen next. Yeah. That was the idea to make it as much as universal and then to not show a specific theme that you tell that it's this. And you have to think this about this work. You just kind of show the idea or the illustration and then open it for the people to think what they want to think about it and then to create their own stories about it. Um, and basically it depends of the wall, but I, I want to try different things. So I want to, sometimes I do a simple wall. Sometimes I do it more complex. It depends of what I feel about the surrounding or what I feel about the wall. Um, but yeah, I kind of kind of like to show, I would say feelings now and like the, um, the state of, of a mind of a person. 
Um, and I want to focus on that team right now. I don't know what I'm going to do in next years, but, but when we started, it was different. We were younger. We wanted to, you know, show everything and, and try ourselves with everything that we could. And, and, and the ideas were, were different because we were just younger and we, we had different perspective for everything. Um, yeah, weather was, was hard for us. It was raining almost every day and we got like problems connected with the rain, basically like everything, just the rain destroyed everything, but we made it. So I'm happy that, that I will, I was able to finish.